Welcome your A finalist in the women's 50 meter butterfly. In lane one, representing Academy Bullet Swim Club, 2013 junior national champ in the 100 free, Mimi Schneider. Lane two, representing Wisconsin Aquatics, a two-time NCAA All-American in the 50 free, Ivy Martin. Lane three, representing the University of Louisville, 2014 NCA silver medalist in the one fly, Kelsey World. Lane four, representing Western Kentucky University, a 2012 US Olympian, picked up a gold medal as a member of the four by 100 medley relay, Claire Donahue. Lane five, representing North Coast Aquatics and USC. 2013 World University Games bronze medalist in the 400 medley relay, Kendall Stewart. Lane six representing Stanford Swimming and North Baltimore. 2014 NCAA champ in the 100 butterfly, Felicia Lee. Lane seven representing the University of Kentucky swim team, a fifth place finisher in the two fly at the 2014 NCAA's Tina Bechtel. And in lane eight representing First Colony and Georgia, 2014 NCAA all of Based on her prelims, and, and this is all about the start, Todd. There, there's no question about it. You've got to get off the blocks. You cannot make up a lot in these 50s if you don't get off well off these blocks. So the women's 50-meter butterfly final now on the blocks. Winner making the world championship team next year in Russia. Good start by Donahue again. Kelsey Worrell actually had the best start of the group, 0.61. A lot of speed early on, Worrell does. She's right there in lane number three. The question is, can she put her hands on the wall at the very end to be able to hang on right here in the middle of the pool, these three lanes? Lane four and lane five as they come to the wall. Too close to call, but it'll be lane five. And Kendall Stewart just edging out Claire Donahue. 25.99, the eighth fastest time in the world this year. Only swimmer under 26 seconds in this field, and she just punched her ticket to Russia. And the only one, because only the winner of this event goes to Russia. Wow. She is now a member of the world championship team. You see Worrell in three off to a really good start. But up there in lane number five, who just Again, did not have a great start was Kendall Stewart, Todd. And you know, she just looks so good. The last 10 or 15 meters, here she is, puts her head down. One, two, three, just perfect at the end and keeps that head down. You want to stick that wall in a perfect fashion, not too short, not too long. And she was just that. And now she gets to go to Russia. So the final results in the women's 50 meter butterfly, Kendall Stewart on the world championship team by virtue of that 25.99. She gets the win just ahead of Claire Donahue and Kelsey Worrell in third. Kendall Stewart is now standing by with Carolyn Mano. All right, guys, I'm here with Kendall Stewart. Congratulations to you, Kendall. You have qualified now for your first world championship team, 2015 in Russia. How excited are you by that news? I'm really excited. <laughs> Um, yeah, it's going to be a blast. Uh, 50 Fly is like the most fun event ever to me, so um, I just have fun swimming it, and it's awesome that I get to do something cool like that. <laughs> Take us through your race. Um, well, I'm pretty slow off the block, so I try to work my underwaters and um, keep my head down in the wall. This morning my fish was really long, so um, I think it was better tonight, so that's good. Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs>
Ladies and gentlemen, award ceremony for the women's 50 meter butterfly. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting these awards, Vice President and General Manager of Arena North America, please welcome Tim McCool. <laughs> Finishing in eighth place from Academy Bullets, time of 26.98, Mimi Schneider. <laughs> Seventh, representing the University of Kentucky swim team, 26.72, Tina Bechtel. Six for Stanford Swimming in North Baltimore at 26.54, Felicia Lee. Fifth for First Colony in Georgia at 26.41, Maddie Locus. Fourth for Wisconsin at 26.37, Ivy Martin. Third for Louisville at 26.35, Kelsey Whirl. Second for Western Kentucky at 26.11, Claire Donahue. And your 2014 Phillips 66 National Champion, representing North Coast Aquatics in a winning time of 25.99, Kendall Stewart. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together here for your top eight. And your national champion, Kendall Stewart, North Coast and USC.